finishing in first place. I know that's just all part of the process and part of the journey and some of you guys aren't thinking about entirely, but it, the accomplishment still must feel pretty good. Yeah, sure, it's a, it's a huge accomplishment for the program and the team and it's sort of a reflection of the hard work that we've put in through the whole year and uh, we're really proud of it, but uh, that wasn't our goal at the start of the year. Our goal is to be playing in the last game of the year, so I've got to keep building to try and reach our goal. Well, Coach, what was your message to your team? Obviously, you make history, but was it your cleanest effort out there? Yeah, it was, uh, it was nice to get the end result, for sure, but the process of getting there definitely wasn't uh, what we'd like. You know, credit to McEwen, they came in and put us under pressure right away with their serve and played well. And, uh, you know, overall, we, we kind of struggled to find our first touch all night. Um, but, you know, thankfully the guys kept their confidence and uh, found ways to score when we needed to and uh, were able to pull it out. A very special moment for you. On a personal level, you become the all-time leader in blocks as a Bobcat surpassing Wall of Famer Joel Small for the mark. How's the accomplishment feel? Uh, yeah, that's a nice little uh, accomplishment for me. I, I saw that it was possible at the start of the season, so I set that as a goal for myself, a little, little challenge, and I'm happy to have uh, got there in the end. Uh, to pass Joel is um, you know, an accomplishment. He's a great player here at BU, and um, yeah, I'm not sure how much longer this uh, record will stand because I think Mason's not too far behind me, so he might catch up pretty quick. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's nice to be uh, nice to break a record.